Advent Devotions for Thursday, 9th of December, 2021. The watchword for today says, Truly, the day of the Lord is great, terrible indeed. Who can endure it? Yet, even now, says the Lord, return to me with all your heart. Joel 2, 11 to 12. The accompanying doctrinal text is Luke 12, 36. It reads as follows. Be like those who are waiting for their master. In this Advent season, let us hear what the Lord will say to us. This watchword tells us that the day of the Lord is a great and terrible day for mankind. Yet at the same time, the God of love, the Almighty, offers us hope and peace if we put our trust and our faith in Him. The Advent season is a time of hope and peace, a time of celebration and anticipation. We look back in celebration of the coming of Jesus Christ as a babe. We should also look back and celebrate the coming of Christ into our hearts when he became our personal savior. At the same time, Advent is also a time of anticipation and looking forward. We look forward as we anticipate the second coming of Jesus as judge and king, and we look forward to spending eternity with him. As we focus on the meaning of Advent, let us spend some time considering our own lives and our commitment to Jesus Christ. During the year, we may have drifted away or not remain as faithful to Christ as when we first believed. However, this passage offers us hope in returning to God. When we return to God with our whole hearts, we can rejoice in the day of the Lord, the second coming of Christ. We will look to Him with joyful anticipation as we await Christ's return. Let us prepare for His coming. Mark 13, 24-37 gives us guidance in this area. Live righteously, encourage one another, trust God, keep the faith, remain hopeful, and keep looking for His return as we continue to do the work He has asked us to do. May the blessings of Advent, joy, peace, faith, and hope be with us all as we celebrate his first coming and anticipate the second coming of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, in this Advent season as we celebrate Jesus' birth and anticipate his second coming, enable us to look to you, our help and sustainer, for all we need. May your peace and joy fill our hearts as we put our hope and trust in your Son, Jesus Christ. We are grateful for your many blessings, your presence, your guidance, and your promises. Thank you for loving us and taking care of us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.